Mums and Calves. The Port River Dolphins usually have calves every three to four years. Calves are normally born tail first and the mother helps to nudge the calf to the surface so it can take its first breath. The calves suckle milk from their mothers and they nurse for 18 months or more. They usually start learning to catch small fish when they are only about six months old, but at this age still rely mainly on their mother's milk. Calves can take a few months to learn to swim properly and they will often lift their whole heads out of the water each time they take a breath. They spend a lot more time on the surface and are not as quick as the older dolphins. It is therefore extremely important that people using watercrafts keep an eye out, obey the sleep limits and do not chase, circle or harass them. Mothers and calves form very strong bonds. The calves usually stay very close to their mothers and will swim along in the slipstream the mother creates as she glides through the water. Sadly, the mortality rate for baby dolphins in the Port River is very high. Unfortunately, around 50% of our baby dolphins do not survive their first year. There are many threats that the Port River dolphins face, including pollution, being hit by boats, or caught in fishing line. Like humans, dolphins also grieve if they lose their baby. Often if they lose their calf, they will push the body around, sometimes for several days. It is a heartbreaking sight to see, and even more heartbreaking to think that us humans may be responsible for some of these deaths. The surviving calves do not generally leave their mothers until they are about three to four years old. They will often head off on their own a few months before the mother has another calf. When calves are still young, they are very dependent on their mums and it is not until they are old enough to do so, usually at least two years of age, that they may venture away. Usually at the age of two, they will not venture away too far and it won't be long before they will be back at their mum's sides again. Sadly, one of our beautiful mother dolphins named Millie suddenly passed away when her calf Ali was only eight months old. At only eight months of age, Ali should still have been relying on her mum for milk and therefore her chances of survival were very slim. Incredibly, Ali survived all odds. She's over two years old now and appears healthy. We often see her at times by herself but also spending times with some of the other dolphins. Hopefully she will continue to do well and will continue to grow and learn from the other dolphins within the Port River pod. While calves are with their mothers, they learn about social interactions and feeding techniques. At times their mothers will tell them off by tail slapping nearly on top of the calves or right next to the calves. As calves grow, they appear to become more confident with their swimming and will swim around, underneath and even over the top of their bumps. They are very inquisitive and will often pop their heads up above the surface to see what is going on. The younger dolphins will watch their mother's behaviour and the behaviour of other dolphins within the pod and will often try to imitate them. They learn an incredible amount in the first few years of their lives. 